Hmm. <laughs> I'm back here again, boss. workers were gone. What could it mean? I don't Stanley know. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh, I still need to find out what happens when I do that. Yeah, we're going to do that quickly before I... What? No, I, no, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game <gasps> completely fresh. Everything should be... Oh, did something change? Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move the story somewhere or... Uh, hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay, then. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. I want to go through this one, but I can't. Curses, if only I knew how to jump. It's truly a tragic story. I never learnt. That just leads into there. This place looks familiar. What? What did that read? Inner guilt. I'll Everyone knows that. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you, there definitely was a story here before. Do we just? Do we need to restart the game again? Eh, not quite. I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting Everyone knows over what and you over did. again. They're just holding it's back to this. let you Okay, talk let's give it a shot. Thoughts. Why not? Oh, I was reading. Now Hartman's angry bird. Gunk. Garrod Gunk. were gone. What could it mean? I don't Stanley know. decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. It is quite possible. Right. Why does this is Okay, yep, it's worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? I guess so. I thought I was gonna keep resetting. I don't know. What have I done? something the story here it comes no, oh wait never mind not the story okay let's head back the other way and retrace our steps am i gonna be in an endless hallway again oh wait now this well i'll be honest i don't recognize this place at all is this the story i don't think so I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place Ooh. in an office building. It, is it's that a correct? Bucket. Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? What do you know what? Remember what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Hey, nice! Congratulations! I know you put in a lot of hard work, and it I really did. paid off, so good job. I did. Oh, no. I have no idea how no, I did I that. Right I'm just this pretty all. talented, I we must say. Know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. What? Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Oh, whoops. Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time. I have to restart. End is never the end, isn't it? All right. I've got a solution. <laughs> this time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Just follow the line. How simple is that? I ain't trust no one. No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. Okay. But... Originally, we went. Okay, let's go. Let's have a look. Let's see. I do like the yellow. It's a nice 
You see? Color. The line knows where the story is. Mm -hmm. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to it's destiny. Here. The, here's a thought. Nope. Wouldn't wherever we Why end doesn't up be that one have a number? Even if there's no story there. Or to put it another way, hmm. is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the yeah. act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Well there. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct oh. of one subjective experience of that Didn't existence, I... right? Okay. okay, I'm now, confusing if my myself, man. experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this <laughs> office, in fact, the skeleton oh, of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I, I was going. I accept your apology. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Do I want to no. that, that, that. I hope that's not copyrighted. This is a nice office. Wish I could. Why can't. Hmm. 06. Huh. Damn I have been struggling to go through some doors. Now I'm just thinking of Spider-Man. Oh, Spider-Man. Such a good movie. Like the original trilogy with um, Tobey Maguire. Just good suit. Though I did see the most recent one. That one. Oh. I wasn't quite sure how it was going to go. I just thought as long as they have um, Tobey and Garfield. I was going to be happy. Oh, Andrew Garfield. Yeah. Fine. It's a good movie. I would recommend watching it if you haven't. You have an office job? Nice. I won't go and ask what sort of job you do because that's probably a bit private. <laughs> Andrew Garfunkel. <laughs> Where did this line come from? <laughs> I'm getting so lost. Cut in... the music. Go back and look at that fern. What? What fern? Wait. What? We're back at the office? No. No, no, line. You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? Oh, Stanley, fern. This fern will be very important later in the story. I'm sure it Make will sure be. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. Yep. All right, didn't I just go? Did I just go through? You know what? I'm going back to my office. There it is. Why does my office feel different? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Am I wanting to go through this way again or not? Uh How could you have done this? And they're still fired. We trusted you after everything. 104. Through, you... 104 oh, was fired. This anymore to hell with it. Restart. <laughs> you know what, Stanley? I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're oh. intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something yeah. exciting, daring, mysterious. 
Ooh, this all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in, well, I don't know. How about oh. this direction? That's interesting. Oh, I am terrible at pronouncing things, so do forgive me. Holland, Hollows? Hollowens project? I'm bad with saying words, so. Interesting. Now, yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Go on. Dragons. Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, Stanley. Oh, wait, penguins. I'm ready for it. I want penguins. Yeah. Oh, no, not you again. Stanley, I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it, and we should be fine. Okay. Where'd it go? I feel like the line is going to be the bad guy of this. It's just going to come out of nowhere ah, and stab me. Choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. Is How it? important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay, so I know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere, the place where we're trying to go, oh, wait. there must be a reverse door. That's that a nice there. color. And that in turn means that our destination yeah, look at corresponds that with the red is a good color, like doors origin. crimson. So starting from the that red, is. Does anybody else have like a favorite door, color? Lead us to where we're going. And since the narrator's the here, are nice. Nice. In all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Augment Another Augment victory for logic. logic. Oh. Come, Stanley. Our destiny. That's really awaits. cool. Huh. Uh, would I have to wear glasses for like a. If I had to wear a headset? Would I still have to wear my glasses, or would I be able to see things still? Orange. That is a good color. Like, would I still... Would I still be able to see things? Okay. Because that's just something that's made me curious, because... I think I've only done it once, and they, and they told me to wear my glasses. So I was just curious if I was meant to or not. Oh. Yep, now that makes sense. Oh, hold up, what's this? Hmm. Hmm. The confusion ending. First You're telling me start. that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? And we're supposed to restart the game eight, eight times? That's really how all this goes? It's oh. <laughs> determined. So now, according Bookstore. to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just oh. supposed to forget? <laughs> well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this this thing wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? Don't worry. No, it can't be. I don't, Let's do this together. To we'll a, both I forget. I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. I don't want to Bye, be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Okay. And the time return stopped. Does that mean... Um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The, um, whatever it is that made this schedule? How would huh. we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? Perhaps you should reset the game and find out. So, okay. I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah. I'm quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that There's life is chair. about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. This is my what new favorite mean? character. <laughs> I didn't expect the honk. <laughs>
All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. When Stanley came to a set of two open... This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Yes. Standing now in this incredible room, Water. Stanley for the first time understood true happiness. Then yeah. the feeling went away, and he, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. This is what I wanted to do before we went down that um, extreme so rabbit hole. Directions. It's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that what the story has been about nothing but you all this time. I would There's like to do that next time. Stanley. Try and get onto someone the floor. floor. Not on that. Please, the, yeah. Stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Now, I'm not asking for me, I'm asking for her. Uh, for who? Who's her? Eh, yeah, probably will be. Let's try. But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. I Good skipped job, a few Stanley. stages. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. <laughs> I skipped a few stages and that just went to the end. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. But now... Uh, will I follow the rules? When Stanley came no. To a set of two open I have one more thing I want to do on this side of the door. Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Well, it's a nice lounge. Uh, it could right be ahead. better. Butterflies in his stomach. Like, Get it could be better. Never known before. But that's on them. Is it this room? Oh, it's your nice. connection between the two? Could a man love a room? I mean, truly, truly, deeply, madly, love. Narrator, are you okay? Yes. Let's sleep. But eager to get back to business, <laughs> Just Stanley took the first open door on his left. It's a good thing I know my left from my right. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. I just struggle going through doors. <laughs> Why? Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. Probably. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this Man, that's time. a lot of boxes. There's someone you've been neglecting, they... Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. Oh. Please, stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Do I that would I'm reach that high? Me, I'm asking for her. This is now, it, Stanley. Who is Your her? chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. She's been waiting. Uh. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this. To reach out to her. If you can truly place your faith in another, then pick up... Oh, no, 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 you can't... Did you just unplug the phone? Now, that wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? You actually chose incorrectly. I didn't even know that was possible. Let me double check. No, I'm back at it again. Very tall forklifts, yes. Very tall. Or maybe they just stack them? They could do that. comes in, fade to white, roll credits. Not picking up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. How is that even possible? None of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I guess this means I'm going to have to go through that door again. Just one more time. What did you... Wait a second. Did I just see... No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? Oh. You're not Stanley. You're a real person. <sighs> I can't believe I was so mistaken. 
This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. If you'd made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol for real-world decision How is that still did blinking? Did you not grasp the severity of the situation? Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Please observe this helpful instructional video. Choice. It's the best part of being a real person. But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Stephen has a choice. He has helping improve the quality of life for citizens of impoverished third world nations. Or he could systematically set fire to every orphan living in a 30 kilometer radius of his house. Uh -oh. Which choice would you My make? friends know me too Remember well, I do. Like here, the real world <laughs> makes sense, and at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, <laughs> in all likelihood, that person is not real. Allow the person to finish their thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, My goodness, is it 4.30? I'm My goodness, is it 4.30? Zack and crack. Zack, crap and Zack, what? Practice. Uh, what were the words Excellent. again? Making choices on a regular basis is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. Most medical professionals recommend making at least eight choices per day. Do you make more than eight? Less? And finally, if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution to the world, just remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant and the feeling should subside. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Big uh, orphanage burning fan. I, I know Mr. that's why you followed. This film has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. But not to worry. Now that you're properly informed hey, on good decision making, bunch. we're going to revisit a choice you made. I'm so glad that you showed me this. And see what the correct thing to do would have been. This way, please. Also. Yes, back to the um, burning of orphanages. I, like a little joke I have with my friends is that <laughs> I am, well, I'm known as Durnak, the orphanage burner. They haven't been able to figure out it's me yet, and they're just so me Wait a second, I'm... Let's worry not about my um, burning stuff, but... We can't have you jumping off the platform and dying. Imagine the main character dying senselessly halfway through the story. That story would make no sense at all. Yeah, Just imagine to get that. You home as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets any worse. Unfortunately, it seems this place is not well equipped to deal with reality. You saw the orphanage tactic. Yeah. Like, I do admit, sometimes people think that I'm the um, orphan burner, but that's only because the orphans weren't able to get out of the building. Uh, no one's recording this, right? We're we're fine. We're f we're gonna continue. We're gonna play the game as it was intended, and forget that I um incriminized incriminized. Yes. Almost there. <laughs> You'll take the door on the left, back to the correct also, ending. The story will have resolution nice once Isaac. again. Is that Isaac? Home Is that... In the real world. I think that's Isaac. Now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not too late. Right. 
Oh, funky room, funky! Imagine having an office that looked like that. That would, that would be cool. I will get through this door. I made it. Ruined. You, I can't believe, after everything we talked about, that you... My story! You've destroyed my work! Why? For what? What did you get out of that? What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone? Left here like so much garbage, it... Well, yeah, it's worth this now. And what am I supposed to do? Even if there were a way to continue, would it be worth it? To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I can't erase that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. Reliving its impossibility forever. Oh, I couldn't live that way. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? Oh, I don't know. What's the answer? What do I do? What do I do? What do I... Ooh. No, I have to. Can I? I have to shut the game down. I have to. No, I can't. I have to. Get everywhere? Is that what that said? Get Chris out of the... Pot. Doors are hard. I struggle. I'm here. I'm still here. Here in this pile of rubbish. With you. You. Who yeah, thought you were so clever. Still now where we are. Okay, I'm no, the door is destroyed. stopping me, so I can't go through. That's not my fault this time. Run it into the ground. What, did you think that would be funny? Yes. You just had to see... Didn't I impress upon you how important it was to be like Stanley? He actually knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, there's a damn good reason for it. That thought hadn't even occurred to you, had it? It had. There's a world outside of you. You're a child. Uh, mm, uh -oh. Not anymore. My story. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It would have been so perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard. That sounds familiar for some... I... Behave exactly first time standard. playing it, but... That means choosing I have seen a bit of it. Always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry! Just behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I'm trying so hard, but got so far. In the end, it doesn't even no. matter. Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. Is behaving. Get Chris out of th I am not get Is that who I have in my closet? I've never asked about their name, so it's quite when possible. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh no, it's just a black screen. I did break it good. I am slightly scared that this isn't the game and I actually have broken it. <laughs> Is, would that be like a 
talented thing to have actually broken the game somehow. Yeah, I guess I have broken it. True, true, true. Oh, a game tester. What sort of games did you test out? Oh, I haven't. But, mate. Maybe this is actually just a secret thing and I just absolutely broken it.